So it's that awareness of what's going on inside. And we often go so fast that we run over the top of that. So interoception is being aware of physical sensations, but it's also being aware of kind of emotions and, and, and mental state at that time. So just having that space where you can check in with yourself, things like mindfulness meditation, also very important, uh, at least worth a try. It's not for everyone, but it's worth a try to experiment. And you just check in with yourself and you say, what do I need? Space, number one. And the second one, engage with other people and you get an external view and you have a conversation. It could be this mental relationship that we talked about before. It could be friends, it could be family, it could be your kids, right? You, you, you get another view and they say, hey, dad, mum, what's going on? You're, you're very angry recently or you're very irritable or you know, you're smiling a lot more or you're not smiling as much. So you get that external view. And then I think the third element is just get informed, right? You, you find out some of the, the, the nuts and bolts, some of the information that you need to then take action uh, on whatever element of well-being that you need, right? You read articles, you buy a book, you, you go online and, and you find out some of the answers yourself. But the first thing is you, 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 you identify the questions. You don't jump necessarily to solution mode. I think we're always mm. trying to solve, but mm -hmm. sometimes you need to just think, okay, well, what's the question first? That's the most important thing.